Hello everyone and welcome to my Itali Italian Grand Prix predictions. Just, you know, a little disclaimer. This is heavily inspired by P1, Matt and Tommy. You know, of course, for some of my predictions and how I do them. But anyways, let's get started with the driver who I think is going to have a bad weekend. It's just a prediction, not saying or not putting any slack against them. Let's go. I think Carlos Sainz is going to have a bad weekend. He was just having two... You know... The uh, the luck might shine again for the Tafosi. I'm sorry whoever hates him this in the comments. But yeah, I believe Carlos Sainz will have a bad weekend. Now, for a good weekend, let's go to... I'm building a whole team. I'm putting Williams. We'll have a good weekend, of course. Oh, this is obviously an easy one. If Monza... I'll say Albon Podium, maybe. Not sure, though. I'll say they have a good weekend. Sergeant will finally get his first point. After that bad weekend he had in... Uh, the Bell, not the Belgium, it's Zanvoort. So I'll say they have a good weekend. And yeah. Anyways, here's my top three. I'll say Verstappen wins the race. Leclerc. No, I'll say Leclerc comes. I'll say Leclerc comes third, because Ferrari and Paris come second. I think Ferrari offers the home crowd boost, but I think they generally do always do pretty well around Monza. Of course, twenty nineteen, they did pretty well there last year as well. So I don't know. I just feel like you know with the. With their performances, like where they can do well, it's, it's, they gotta do well at Monza. Or else the Tofosi won't be very happy about that. Yeah, but Verstappen will go match Vettel's record. Well, go beat it, I mean, like with 10 wins in a row, which would just be insane. And he'll also um, break that curse. What is it called? Right? The Monza curse. Like, whoever wins the race, do enough in that fear. Uh, Gasly won in 2020, you know, Leclerc won in 2020, DNF'd in, Leclerc won in 2019, DNF'd in 2020, Gasly won in 2020, DNF'd in 2021, Ricardo won in 2021, DNF'd in 2022, but Max is obviously going to break that, just see how we brought, broke the first race win in the season curse, he broke that, but yeah, that's it for that. Anyway, now for a new segment, George's crazy prediction. My crazy prediction. I am saying that... Hmm, let me think about this. I'll say two DNF. Two or like less than four. Less than four, I'll say. Less than four DNF. I hope this one is a dry race. We haven't really had a dry race in a bit. A dry race where, like, yeah, this on track overtakes, but reliability isn't too bad. And yeah. I'll hope for, like, two DNS. Maybe, we'll, you know, maybe, we'll, you know, I mean, not like me one. Maybe one of the half drivers or, or, um, Al, well, or, like, Alfa Romeo or something like that. Something along the lines of that, maybe. But yeah, that's. Anyways, that's it for my Monza predictions. Be sure to disagree or agree in the comments. These are all my predictions for what I think is going to happen. But yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.